In the Be In Touch CRM, your client records are all kept in an organized, easy to navigate database. You can access and manipulate these files using the mortgage record list. All records in your Be In Touch CRM, whether added manually, generated from a partner portal, or imported to your system, will be listed here. To access this list at any time, simply click the Mortgages tab. The organization of the Mortgages tab will depend upon the view settings that are currently in place for your CRM. Sub-tabs at the top of the page will allow you to quickly browse subsets of your client database. You may want to categorize your borrower records based upon their step in the marketing sequence pipeline, by group association, or by another customized view system. View settings can also determine which fields appear in the borrower record list to the right of a client's name. To learn more about the views available in your CRM, please watch our View Settings training video in this series. Below the sub-tabs, you will see a list of mortgage clients as rows in a table. Details from each client's record will display to the right. Depending on your access privileges in your company, this list will show either all records in your CRM or those specifically assigned to you. Only a portion of your client records will display on screen at a time. You can navigate between pages of records using the numbers and arrows in the lower left corner of the page. You can also change the number of records that display on each page using the menu in the upper right corner. Note that displaying more records at once may affect page loading times. You can also choose whether to display borrowers with multiple mortgage loans as a single record in the list or as multiple entries using the menu to the right. The list of records can be reordered by clicking on any of the column headers. Clicking on a header again will reverse the sorting. Any new records that haven't been opened yet will appear in bold. Individual records can be opened and edited by clicking on the borrower name. No matter which view is used, several options will be available for records in the Mortgages tab. Actions can be taken on multiple records at once by using the checkboxes to the left and the buttons above the record list. Which options appear as buttons here will depend upon the modules that are active for your account. If you do not see a button covered here in your CRM and would like it added, please contact your administrator. Tracker Report will let you see all tracker events that have been created for the selected records. To learn more about how the event tracker works and the reports available for it, please watch our Borrower Event Tracker training video in this series. Send Emails will open an email editor and add the selected records automatically listed as recipients. Print Labels and Print Letters will do the same for physical mail communication instead of email, allowing you to print mailing labels or pre-made letters uploaded to the Marketing tab, Documents Library. When you click Start Stop Campaign, you will see a list of your marketing campaigns, which you can then either start or stop for all checked records. You can set a date and time for the campaigns to start, and you can even restart campaigns for records that already have the campaign started. The Assign Records button will show a list of your CRM users, who you can then assign the ownership of selected records to. Move records can be used to change the marketing sequence stage for the selected records, or to change the groups assigned to the records. You can select multiple groups for each record using the checkboxes in the list, or you can remove the records from all groups using the box below the menu. If you have selected only two records that are assigned to the same user, you can use the Merge button to sync the information in both records into a single one. You will be shown a list of the information for both records, and you can choose which record's information will be kept in the new file using the radio buttons. You can use the Select All buttons at the top of the list to mark all subsequent files for that record. Then, you can select to combine them into a single record, combine information to both records to associate with one contact record, or simply keep the selected record and remove the unselected one. Delete can be used to remove multiple checked records at once. Lastly, the Send SMS button allows you to compose an SMS text message and send it to each of the selected records. 
This feature is only available to accounts with the BN Touch Voice module active that have enabled the bulk SMS setting. Similarly, the PB Dialer button is used to make phone burner calls to the selected records if that module is enabled. You may have noticed two icons adjacent to the Mortgages tab at the top of your screen. The plus sign icon can be used to create a new mortgage record. When you add a new client, you can enter information manually using the text fields below. You can include as little or as much information as you'd like. You can add the new record to any relevant groups using the drop-down menu at the top of the page, and new groups can be created using the Manage Groups button. Alternatively, you can import a record from a Fannie Mae 3.2 file by clicking the Import FN 3.2 button at the top of the screen. When importing records, make sure each file has a unique file name. When finished entering borrower information, click the Add Record button to create the new borrower record. Once you do, it will be added to the borrower record list, and you will be taken to the Mortgage Info section of the new record. More options are now available for adding information to the record. These new options and data fields are separated into various sub-tabs. The second icon to the right of the Mortgages tab is a small magnifying glass. Clicking this will open the Pick a Search, a highly customizable record finding tool. To learn more about finding mortgage records, please watch our Pick a Search training video in this series. Thank you for watching this training video. To learn more about the Be in Touch CRM, please check out our YouTube channel.